Yeah, if you want to do studs first, we can. Might as well do the studs first while we got more room to swing. We should probably get your dad to stop. There's a meat bag. Eight chicken BLT breakfast sandwiches. Can I also have a box of coffee? Coffee for the crew this morning, sponsored breakfast for everybody. So I'm picking it up, bringing it out there. And while I wait for my order, I have to admire my mud flaps. Okay, we got the new wheel studs in here finally. So I can actually, that was only a two day wait, so that's not that bad. We'll throw them in here and then we get the tires mounted. Okay, so with these planetary wheel studs, you'll notice they're, they're notched on the top. These planetaries are a little big, but this notch holds those bolts centered from turning too. So instead of taking these shoes off, we're just being lazy and we're just rotating it around. Then we can use this gate gap right where the S cam is in order to get them on in. It's a pain, but it's not as much pain as removing the brakes. It's the lining up that square part perfectly. That's the pain. These things are press fit so that there's no slop. Cause if you had slop, you'd end up damaging the studs, which would damage your rim. This one was moving all the steel and the hammering. There's gotta be some beauty shots. We had a couple people reach out in the comments in the last video asking that just be like hey can you throw those old wheel studs up as uh merch so we'll get these engraved with edison motors and we you can have some official edison motors incorrect wheel studs i want a piece of the first truck i want a piece of the first truck spring it out pull the bar under let it snap on yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm just gonna... there we go Still lined up. There you go. Screwdriver, impact, I'll never see you. Always put never sees on a semi truck lug nut. I don't care what people say, it's better. Because once you've been in the bush and you've been working on a trailer, some log trailer that hasn't had its wheel nuts off Welcome in a year, home. nothing you is a pain in the ass. Yep. You lined up? Yep. You lined up. Okay. Way, yeah. These ones were actually going to sleeved. These fill up that little bit of gap in the rim, takes all the slop out. But they are a pain to install because you have to be precise. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. I got this one. Oh gravy. That's got her. We have a truck. Yep. It is now. Our truck is now sitting on its own tires. Oh, we're on the jack still, but hand here. We'll move this rear. Uh... Oh my god, this thing has been on here for eight, nine months. If we flop it, someone's gonna trip on it, and then we're gonna pick it back up again. And the last jack's off. Last jack's off. The eagle has landed. Oh, good job, guys. Oh. That was my bad arm. <laughs> I forgot that. It's not quite all the way healed. <laughs> Whose fault was that? I don't know. I didn't use my bad arm. So now we just grab the backhoe and pull it around the arc for a promo shoot? Yeah, we'll <laughs> do a Nicola <laughs> thing. Nicola. Yeah, we can actually just coast and push it around now. We got the back end chopped off. I will, but we'll just have to wait for Dean. 